Trafficking and exploitation is not only about numbers, it's about people's life. Even one person, one victim of trafficking is too many. Uh, Serbia is a country of origin, transit and destination for the victims of trafficking. Uh, most of our clients are women and girls uh, who are sexually exploited, but more and more cases we have on labor exploitation, forced begging, forced criminality. Uh, most of the victims are recruited through internet and through the people they trust, family members, uh, relatives, but also lover boys and other people they trust. And that is something that actually is the hardest to explain at the end, especially in the court procedures, you know. When we started in 2000, 2001, in that period, the majority of the victims were coming from outside. So we had victims from Russia, Moldova, Ukraine, uh, Bulgaria, Romania. Nowadays, majority of the victims actually are coming from the territory, are citizens of Serbia, who are internally trafficked, but also internationally. We are working firstly in direct victims assistance program, then we have a prevention and education program, advocacy and researching. It's not only an uh, issue about equality between men and women, it's also about power, it's also about violence. Uh, we are talking here about huge and severe violation of human rights. Astra is a member of many different networks, national and regional and international ones. For us, it's really important to share our experience, to broaden their knowledge, uh, to know how to prevent and how to protect victims in the local societies. Uh, these uh, organizations that are members of the anti-trafficking networks are located in different towns uh, throughout Serbia. So in this way we can manage to work with the victims in different towns and to coordinate the support and the protection and direct victims assistance in, in different regions of Serbia. On one hand we are providing direct assistance to victims, we are providing services. Uh, also, we are monitoring what government is doing in the institutions or, uh, if they are uh, respecting victims' right, uh, rights in each segment. But on the lo longer perspective, uh, what we want is actually society which is zero tolerance to trafficking and exploitation, where, where there is no trafficking, no exploitation.